Hello everyone. Today, we are going to create 3D book album slideshow animation in After Effects. So, this is our second part. In the first part, we created front cover, back cover, and spine for our 3D book album animation. But now, we are going to enter into After Effects to complete our animation. So, without any further discussion, let's jump into After Effects. So, here it is. First, create new composition for our project. I am using this preset. You can use any of them. I don't want to make change in these default settings. Set time duration to 20 seconds. Click OK. Now, we have to import our files in project panel. Select these files then right click and click on new comp from selection. Must check these settings on multiple compositions. And click OK. It will create separate compositions for these files. Now, import our background image. I have downloaded these images from unsplash.com. Select this image and click on import. Hold this file and bring it into our comp make it 3D from this icon. Scale it down little bit. Perfect. Now, save this project on desktop. Now, drag these files one by one into our comp and make them 3D. Set these layers into sequence. Now, set these layers as a book. First front cover then spine and then back cover. I am using Anchor Point Mover plugin. That is given by Animation Composer. You can download it easily through link in the description. Connect these borders. Set the anchor points of these layers to the turning point. Now, parent front cover to the spine layer and parent spine layer to the back cover layer. Now select these two layers. And hit R button to open rotation options. Set keyframes of Y rotation as showing in this video. Select these keyframes and forward them. Perfect. Open front cover comp. Right click on this layer and go to transform and hit flip horizontal. You can see the changing. Now, create camera layer. I am using default settings and you can also follow these settings. I am using these shortcuts for camera movements. Hit C button on keyboard for changing camera tools. Drag it to the center.
move this BG layer also to the center. I am changing camera tools by pressing C button. Now, animate camera position. Hit stopwatch icon to animate. Go back to the start of the timeline and set camera position according to your choice. I am okay with this settings. Perfect. Select these both keyframes and hit F9 to easy ease them. You can see here the BG color is black. So, it seems bad to me. I am changing it to another color. Now, we are going to add here a page inside this book. Press Ctrl D for duplicate this layer. Remove parent access. Also duplicate this layer in project panel. Hit Alt and hold this layer to the above of the layer for replacing it. There is some mistakes in it. So you have to correct it. You can follow my steps. Open up this layer to edit it. Press Ctrl Y and add a light grey solid BG layer for page. Perfect. Rename this layer to page 1. Hit R and open rotation properties. Hit stopwatch of Y rotation to set keyframes. Go forward in timeline and set value to 359. Perfect. Select both keyframes and make easy ease them by hit F9. And you can duplicate more pages to add other pages. Right here page 1. Align it to the center. Both layers got same changing just because of same composition. Just duplicate this layer into the project panel and replace it to the page to layer in composition panel. In this way, you can add more pages to this book. It is important to make sequence in this composition panel.
Hold page 2 layer to the down. Now, you can add text. Flip horizontal the text layer only. Do same to the second layer. Right here page 2. And align it to the center. Also transform it to the flip horizontal. Now, preview our project. Perfect. Add wiggle expression to the orientation properties of camera layer. Hit Alt plus left mouse button to add expression. You can see the changing. Camera is wiggling too much, so just set the numbers to 0.5 and 1. Perfect. Now, you can add light layer to this project and make it more realistic by shadows and lightness. Create spotlight layer. Set light to the above of the front page layer. You can see the changing. The pages are becoming more dark in the absence of light. Make it more realistic by opening cast shadows setting and set on to cast shadows. You can play with these settings for creating more interesting and realistic R animation. but I am deleting this light layer and make it cartoonish type animation and now render this animation and view it it's perfect now like this video share and subscribe to support us thank you